What's up everybody, it's the Unobtainium here, and I've got something special for you all. I've got a compilation of three worlds here, themed around the various movies made by Hayao Miyazaki. So you've got like Spirited Away and Lapita and whatnot. And so what I thought I'd do is I'd do a sort of three-part special, maybe more, for this one, the Oz Workshop, because it's pretty, uh pretty darn intensive. I haven't even explored all of it yet, so that'll be fun. But yeah, three or more parts, just sort of talking about all the different ones and exploring them. And so I thought we would start with Lapida, since that one seems to be the smallest here. Alright, we've spawned in what appears to be a bedroom here. Nice little pool of water, three beds, it's perfectly necessary. Crafting tables, inexplicably, amongst bookshelves, and a couple paintings staring out at me. That's cool. Here's a staircase. Let's go down. Why not? The rack, soul sand. There must be a texture pack that you need for this, because if there is, I didn't see it. Slash didn't download it. Interior garden, we'll check that out. Kitchen and dining hall, I haven't seen this. Let's check it out. Oh, that's cool. Not much of a kitchen, though. It's just a fireplace and some stuff. And there's some clouds out there. Chests. Gotta love those lighting errors, huh? Cold storage. Ah, uh, it's just chests. What do you, what do you know? Morning, dining, oh, this is the kitchen, oh, okay. This is the dining hall. I see. Clever, clever. Let's go check out some more stuff here. What I've seen, this is a pretty crazy build. Outside, we'll go outside when the time comes. Study slash bedroom. With an inexplicable floating sign, I don't know how that works. But it's doing it, so it's not my place to argue. Ooh, this is nice. It's a nice little fountain. Bookshelves, and... Bedroom. Oh, it's a loft. Ooh, I like this. This is nice. I'm gonna get a lot of architectural inspiration from this map, I presume. Oh, here's... What appears to be a table for people to chill out on. Oh, that goes into the interior garden. We'll check that out later. It's up here. Oh, whoa. This appears to be a common room of some sort. I got lava there. It's serious. Got some netherrack up in the top there. Have to see if I can. Oh, I get it. Fire and ice. Ah, that's cool. Nice little bookshelves and some palm wood. Uh, what have we got here? Ooh, some paintings. My paintings, in case you're wondering, are sprites. Are themed around different SNES games. So I'm going to assume that that's some sort of Castlevania reference. Go ahead and tell me I'm wrong. I honestly don't care. I don't know what it is, so... It's probably my best guess. Oh, that's scary. Pig. Shoved his fat face right in mine as I came up getting night outside. Oh, this is garden study. It's just grass. Works. Another floating sign. What's the deal with these? Oh my god, they're everywhere. Study plus bedroom slash exit. Okay. So we're in the central tree area here. This is the interior garden where they have the, uh, the big ass tree. It's impressive feat of architecture there. Looks like a it looks like an actual tree. Let's go back through here. See if we can't find our way outside. Might have to turn it to daytime. Hello, crystal nexus. That's cool. There's a root. Level 
along the outer wall here. That's pretty cool. Another root. Crystal Nexus. What do you say? They keep telling us it's here, so might as well go see it. Let's see if we can get a view inside. Ooh, wow. That's pretty crazy. Don't know how well my computer's gonna handle this since this is basically the equivalent of an oxen powered thing. Whoa ho ho. That's pretty cool, if I do say so myself. There's got the dirt floor and all the tree roots coming down. I just have to wonder, how is this really plausible for a tree like this to survive with no roots? Or no water? I mean, there's water here, but the tree's roots are not going into it as far as I can see, and it's got a very thin layer of dirt. I mean, it's, it's clearly, it, it's just powered by the crystal or something, but that's kind of an interesting thought. And this water fountain here, very elegant, surprisingly well lit as well. I'm surprised it's not darker, because trying mid-level garden. I thought that said medieval garden for a second, and I was about to go all grammar Nazi on them. It's medieval, spell with an E, man, come on. Um, here we go, we're in the Citadel Library, apparently. Oh, wow, that is probably more books than, I don't know. It's, it's just amazing. That's a lot of books that take you years to read. Take me, like, forever to read, and I read fast. I read, like, you know, a book like Dune in a matter of months. Potion Room, what's in here? Potions, maybe? up here. No potions. This is Minecraft 1.0, so I'm at perfect liberty to just plunk down a couple of cauldrons and some potion racks. But I don't want to do that, because I don't want to spoil everything. But, so yeah, you can pretty much see right there, there's the Citadel Library. I'm gonna walk down around here, another staircase. Ooh, don't fall in. Is that a is that a bug? Should that be there? Well why? Why? Why is this here? What is what purpose does this little alcove serve? Oh well, not my place to question these kinds of things. What is this? What is this? The Forbidden Library. No trespass. Trespassing. We got in here anyway. Afraid to ask. Chests and books. More books. If I had the book mod, I'd have probably come through here and vandalized it a bit, but. But no, it's just library. It's cool. I'm not going to argue. Alright, for the sake of speeding things up here, I'm going to turn on creative and just fly up through here. Whoa. Purple. Whoa. Never noticed that. That's pretty cool. They got nether portal blocks running onto the bridges here. That's pretty, pretty nifty. Alright, let's go out here to the outer wall, turn creative off again. Outer ring. I wonder is there anything nifty in these columns? Wagering not, but you know, never hurt to look. Ah, clouds. This is just an amazing map, just in general. It's beautiful. The clouds are cool. The the tree is amazing. Let's climb back up through here again. I've seen all there is to see in there. There's not much. Um yeah, that's pretty cool. Ooh, there's ladder. Um, I would jump over there, but I am really seriously doubting my... Let's go do that. Alright. Creative. Turn that off. Creative off. And away we go. I'm going to see if I can jump down that crazy bollocks. You know what? Let's just the hell with it. We're flying around this thing. Flying around Lapita. That would have helped in the movie, wouldn't it? 
all those people falling off of the airships and whatnot. That'd be scary as hell, and I bet they wish that they had my powers. Whoa, is there some sort of hidden control room down there that I didn't see? Circle around it for other funky Easter eggs. I had nothing there. Um, oh, wow. Nice little glowstone there. Gives it the sense it's hovering. Let's turn off a set time to noon. Okay, there we go. Oh, oh, shoot. That was close. This almost died. There's the outer rings. Beautiful as always. There's the tree. What is this? How nice. They have little floating islands. Oh, this one's got ice in it for some inexplicable reason. If I were to make a server on this, I would take control of that uh, giant thing right there and then uh, just force everybody to these outliers. Go, wood. Make do. There's an outside view of the tree. That's amazing. It's rendering slow because my computer is a master, massive pile of a dookie. Oh, whoa! That's cool. Look at that. There's a windmill. Never figured out what these were. I can't really tell. They appear to be floating, which is cool, but I don't know why or what they're supposed to be. That's nice. I like the fence. Think outside the box. I've never seen that before. If I'm late on that, go ahead and tell me. I don't care. It's cool looking. And as I expected, there's nothing up here that would uh, constitute a house. It's just a windmill. Which is perfectly okay. Windmills are badass. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much Lapita. So uh, if you like the video, remember to rate, comment, subscribe. And there's more Miyazaki coming. See ya.